Hey guys, and welcome back to Scotty Knows. Um, I know it's been a while since I posted a video, uh, but in the last video, I was kind of mentioning I was actually redoing my bathroom, so I've been kind of focused on that and took a family vacation and all that good stuff. So I am starting to get my garage back. I got most of the stuff out of here, um, just the material from the uh, bathroom. I'll take you guys and show you that because Scotty Knows. Um, but just a quick update here on the Civic. Um, so I'm still working on bleeding the clutch. Um, I gotta put some air in my tire, so that's gotta happen. Um, so I've actually got some recommendations on probably gravity bleeding the clutch, uh, which I may do um, here soon and actually get this thing up and running because I wanna actually drive this thing since it's summertime. But on the other note is I do have my block back over here. So I got it back. Everything is cleaned up a little bit. Everything is looking good. Um, I'm going to rebuild this motor. It's the D16Z6, so stay tuned for that series. Um, I'm actually going to have to hone everything out, get everything done. Um, I'm going to paint it and all that good stuff. So I do have some parts coming for that. Um, and, of course, you know, the head here. Nice and shiny. So I'm going to get everything kind of refreshed. Um, I do have some new pistons and new rods coming in. So that will be in the next video for the D16Z6 build, more than likely. Since I'm getting the H-beam rods, I'm going to have to actually uh, notch out the block a little bit. So you get to go along that process with me. But slowly cleaning up the garage a little bit. Everything's coming along. Can't wait to hop back on this thing. Just wanted to give everybody a quick update. But let me pop in the bathroom. I'll show you uh, what Scotty knows. So not only do I work on cars, but I renovate houses too. Um, it's about 95% done here in the bathroom. It's looking good. I got another cabinet I got to hang here, as well as a mirror over here. And somewhere I'm going to put a towel bar there, but I think it's looking good. It's actually the first time I did some tile. So I think it came out pretty, pretty smooth. But now that I'm done with this project, I can work on the other ones. So also you guys know, I do also do um, work on my Chevy Trailblazer. I actually have some new axles here. Um, actually, we started working on that prior to me actually uh, building the channel here. Uh, but um, I'm going to actually replace these axles. I'm starting to get like some sort of vibration, um, which I thought was maybe coming from the remanufactured transmission that I did, uh, did the install on. However, um, when I put it in neutral, I can still feel the vibration. So I'm thinking that when I did the whole front suspension, maybe I popped out. Um, one of the axles. So if I'm going to go through all the effort, I'm just going to go ahead and replace and put new ones in there. There's about 140,000 miles on that, that trailblazer. So I'm going to probably uh, do that. Um, but yeah, I'm excited about getting back in the garage here. It's been some time since I worked on these things. I've been accumulating some parts, um, getting my uh, motor back and all that good stuff. So bear with me and we'll go ahead and knock that stuff out. I'm still working on the interior. Still got plenty of work to do. Um, I still got these door poppers and stuff to put in here for the doors for the shaved door handles. So I can't necessarily latch it right now. I do have the locking mechanism kind of taken out at the moment. So this is ready to go. But this motor is actually that I'm building the D16s for the Dell Solar, which is pretty much 100% ready to go. You know, I redid the interior, new carpet, everything is fresh. I got some of the other stuff for the door panel for the Civic, but everything's looking good. And of course, suspension's all done. Probably hard to see, uh, but I do got some Skunks 2s in there, so they're doing pretty well. So real quick back on the block. Um, I'll get this thing uh, um, put back on my motor stand when I get the uh, pistons and rods and test fit it uh, with the crank to, to see where I actually got to notch it out. Um, never notched a block before, but um, everything that I've read, it, it says I'm probably going to have to do that. So what I want to do with this block is actually paint it um, at some point once I get everything kind of test fitted. But once I notch the block, I'm probably going to take it back up to the machine shop uh, just to have... Um, them hot tank it again, make sure I don't have any loose metal shavings or anything like that. But I am putting the build list together for this uh, motor. So the parts that I got coming in is a surprise, so you're going to have to stay tuned for the next video. Um, but hey, you know, it's, it's coming along, you know, slowly but surely. I'm in the summertime, so I got a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff pending. 
I really just wanted to make a quick update video for you guys uh, of the status of everything going on. It's been a while since I posted a video. Um, I just wanted to make some content, put something out, give everybody a status of what's going on here at the Honda Garage. Uh, so stay tuned. I got a lot of stuff coming uh, in store with this motor build. Uh, I'm going to make a video when I do the axles for the Trailblazer uh, back when I'm bleeding this uh, transmission so I, or the uh, slave master say, uh, slave cylinder uh, clutch and all that good stuff. So. I'm gonna make a video on that um, just to kind of give everybody some content. You know, some of you guys follow me on this build, uh, which I truly appreciate. So I appreciate you guys for watching. But that's gonna do it for this quick video. Just a quick update of what's going on here at the Honda Garage. So I appreciate you guys watching. Uh, stay in tune uh, uh, for the builds. Um, but stay tuned for what I got coming in store for you guys. I think you guys will like that. Uh, especially if you're just learning how to build a motor, you can learn with me. Um, that'd be great. So. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, hopefully you watched some of my previous videos. Stay tuned for the new videos with the Civic build, the Honda motor, um, all that good stuff. So a lot more in store for you guys. So until then, please like, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next episode. Peace.